see that out of a player of her size and her stature. Here's Juju on the run, and Tack not having any of it. She almost thought she got no called for a foul. No respect for the number one player in the country. <laughs> Here's Arenas, the floater, no. Kristevsky gets to that bounce. She's got four of the six here for Sierra Canyon. Talking about a lot. She has a lot of promise when it comes to this game. And she's the future of the program. She is. Here's Parker. The floater is good. Parker showing no fear when it comes to trying to shoot the ball on the offensive end. Really love the confidence you see in players when they're just going 94 feet and just showing that they just do not care about who's in front of them. Oh, what a pass! What a feed there from Juju Watkins. No foul, ball out to Krzyzewski, she'll try a three. Air ball, saved into Randolph, pump fake, shuffled her feet, bucket, and the foul. We had a same similar. The hesitation against Watkins, tried to go behind the back, stuffed there by Watkins. And a foul in the backcourt. <laughs> she had to take the ball with her because she wanted to keep it. That's two, her second block of the night. Just great timing, getting up in the air. We've seen a couple. And it's taken over the South Grand Prairie squad. And they become a premier program in the state of Texas as Watkins misses, but Randolph is there for the board. The shovel, Watkins couldn't get it, though. Nice defense from Carr, but Randolph stays with it. I mean, these reps are really letting these girls play physical, and you like to see that them trying to finish through contact. It's interesting to see how long this is going to go in the game. Drop step there, thing of beauty there from Tack. She's looking a lot. Going up against Cunningham. Of La Jolla Country Day. I said it. She was efficient from the field. They had to look for her a little bit more, but I think Brea kind of shot, you know, made them shy. Putbacks, six putbacks a game. You know, easy points get me going off offensive rebounds. You know, you might not be getting the ball. And that's what I try to explain to her. You got to do other things. And like you said, get the rebound and go. And like you said, been around the game and me always talking basketball to her. That been her whole life, you know, from uh, just being, you know, been born in Portland when I started playing with the Trailblazers to the move. Matt, ah, oh, finish that. <laughs> there it goes. And one. There you go. Uh, but no, just. That's a good call around. by you, man. You, you. <laughs> <laughs> Court side, Zach Randolph, the all star, former LA Clipper, along with Memphis Grizzly as well. Here's a three point good attempt. Good. Oh my, good and shot. that one falls from Sheriff. And the timeout taken good here shot. by Brian Raven in South Grand Prairie both teams and how fast the game was going. But for her to get, you know, a quick little breather, she's able to do that. The little dream shake against the freshman and it hits nothing but the bottom of the net. Plus minus stats here at the high school level, but you gotta imagine, it's pretty high for her so far, her impact tonight. Barnes, the offensive rebound, the putback, no, but Tack is right there. The bucket and the foul. And the emotion afterwards. She's getting fired up, folks. The first three steps. Adele Tack has mastered that effort. How important is that? Because people don't think about that or talk about that often. It's it's huge. It's, it's one of those little things that, you know, people don't pay attention to because those first three steps. Back there defensively. I mean, they're banging her up down there, but in a good defense. Juju can't get it, but there's Kristevsky there for the offensive rebound and put back. She's been solid for them on the inside. She has been. She has been really solid. Hand I mean, we asked Coach if there was going to be, is there a problem with the fact that, you know, only four people had the double figures, but it looks like Krzyzewski can definitely be one of those people. There's Parker. Oh, what a find underneath. Set the table beautifully for Tack, and that's how we'll end this first half. Randolph comes over to Shade. Nice rebound there offensively, Madison Key. Three-point attempt is long, and the long rebound is out to Arenas. Here's Randolph initiating the offense, going right at Parker. Stops, blocked there by Tack. She's been doing it all here tonight for South Grand Prairie. I mean, even with the block, the skill set of McKinley is amazing. You heard her father, Zach Randolph, talking about 
that if you were with us earlier. Randolph spent some time playing for the Mamba team, coached by the late, great Kobe Bryant, a teammate. Madison Key against Watkins. Seven on the shot clock now. Barnes, the take off the glass, a thing of beauty. I mean, that's beautiful by Grand Prairie, just to take their time. Parker there it stops goes. and pops. Got the bounce. The triple is good you for just TP said she to shoot Leah that. Parker. You just said she could shoot that. Clapping her hands. There she go, getting fired up for Grand Prairie. Looks like an over and backs. Sierra Kane got away with one there as Juju knocks down the mid-range jumper. And that's what you need from a star player like Juju Watkins. A run that potentially can be started by Grand Prairie. And even though they just get the bucket. Tack now had the freshman on her back. Missed it, but with a little acting, you can get some calls done. Arenas to pull up, and that's true. Someone who can get going in a hurry. And Sierra Kane put her here at Sierra King. Here's Talia Parker trying to thread the needle there for Tack. Here's the home run pass from Watkins to Arenas. The spin that move and the flip. Inside to post up. Madison Key stolen away by Watkins. Watkins in transition. The Euro, the layup, good. Juju Watkins. You can even tell on that last Buck, you see her kind of check the defense, see where they're at, and see that she has the open lane and goes in and scores the bucket. Physical. Tack, the nice pass out for three. And it falls. She had time. Morgan left wide open there. Beautiful touch pass there from Tack. Hit and make those shots. Watkins looking for the foul there, didn't get it. The kick out arena, sets her feet for three. That falls. Five-point lead, Sierra Canyon. Parker defending the cross-court pass to Randolph in the corner. Let's see what she does here. Arenas pulls up. That one goes. Okay, we can definitely call her mini microwave, for sure. Smack it, you know, out of her hands for her teammate to get it. Sierra Canyon up by seven. Watkins to pull up. Good. Mm. Juju Watkins gives the Trailblazers a nine-point advantage. Making sure that they make it hard for Adele Tack to get the balls that she's trying to get. Back the other way, the layup good there by Barnes. And you see South Grand Prairie extending this pressure here. And stolen away, Madison Key. Two on one here for South Grand Prairie. She pulls up and it rattles <laughs> in. And she left it. Top. Timeout taken here by Sierra Canyon. Madison Key. She's been charged with the task of guarding, you know, anybody who has that ball at the top of the key. The crossover by Juju. Leaves it up for the freshman, Kristevsky. <laughs> oh, she gave a, a little pat on the bucket. back. And that might be the deal breaker here. For the freshman having herself a night. Juju in the passing lanes comes up with the steal. You know, and one mixtape right there at half court. Little Curly Neal as well. Foul being taken here. I mean, she has done a tremendous job of having an effect on this game. You know, yeah. yesterday. It's not they, always scoring. It's right? not always scoring, but that's what you need out of a player. I mean, you're the number one player in the country for a reason, and it's not just for scoring. She affected the game, and she had her hand in the game in every way possible.